Today was especially exciting because we have just released six Australian black swans on Jordan Lake and we have not had swans here for 20 years. So this is a very exciting moment. These are the six children of a black Australian swan named Mr. Peepers. And Mr. Peepers was raised from an egg by my friend, Bernice Stableford. She was sadly diagnosed with a terminal disease. And when Bernie died, um, she had Mr. Peepers in her arms. So as sad as it was to lose my friend, um, Mr. Peepers needed a place to go. So uh, Mr. Peepers then went from Bernie to the Webb Corbett Endangered Species Bird Sanctuary. They realized that Mr. Peepers was lonely, so they um, imported an Australian black female. And Mr. Peepers was overjoyed and fell madly in love with this new swan. Well, most swans, when they lay eggs, lay only one or two eggs at the most. But this swan immediately laid six eggs. And uh, Bobby Webb and Michael Corbett called me and said, Help, we can't handle all these swans. Um, these are the children of Octo Swan and Mr. Peepers. So that was the new name for the mother because she was so prolific. And the eggs hatched and the six babies began to grow. And um, so they needed a place to go, and I called John and I said, could we possibly bring these six black Australian swans up to the Jordan Lake? And he said yes. And Tim Spence very kindly built a pen to the specifications that we need with half of this giant pen in the water and half on land. And they've been here a week and becoming acclimated to Jordan Lake. And just a few moments ago, it was such a thrill to see them fly away into freedom for the first time. They were so excited and so beautiful. And these are Mr. Peeper's children. And they are Bernie's, my friend's grandchildren, swans. So it's a wonderful moment for me on so many levels.